New information tonight on the drought in Connecticut. It was just released today and it shows that our state is in bad shape. From moderate drought that you see there in that light tan to extreme drought there in red, every single part of the state is being affected. But one shoreline farm is now going high tech to teach how to grow greens. News 8's anchor Scott McDonald has a closer look. Row after row of vibrant green and red lettuce. At H2O Farms in Guilford, it's the future of food farming. So this is one acre mm -hmm. that you would need 40 acres to get the same output and the same Correct. amount of lettuce. Correct. The new business is growing and a lot less dirt is required. Almost 30,000 heads a week. Already sold in half a dozen marketplaces. We're working with ShopRite uh, and PriceRite. Big Y, we just started with Whole Food. The farm uses deep water hydroponics. First in the country. Growing several types of lettuce like Boston, Green Leaf, Romaine and Red in water. What we can do within seven to eight weeks from seeds to a full grown head, in the regular conventional growth, it will take from seed to a full grown head about four months. It's also drought proof. We don't have issue with the weather. No rabbits to worry about or insects to ward off and forget about the tractor. Uh, we can go even to the climate. Tovia uses a computer program to control the environment. It can even run off of an app. Not only that, if there is something that's out of the ordinary, the system can text you and tell you something is wrong. Based out of Israel, the company was given incentives to move into Connecticut. It's able to harvest lettuce 365 days a year. It's an edge H2O hopes will lead to expansion. We hope so. A business setting down roots of a different kind in Connecticut, but roots all the same. In Guilford, Scott McDonald, News 8.